Hello everyone, welcome to Manari TV. Today is our quiz. Today is that so? Please wait for me, I'm already done now. Ah, ah. What kept you so long? Oh, sorry, I was dressing up now. Where is Josephine? Josephine, she knows her way to the school. Yes. No, no, that's not right. Josephine! 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 Come now, let's go. Come here, go. She got the you're going to. Uh-uh. We're going to school. Which school? Didn't I tell you last night that I'd be going to the farm this morning to complete the work at the farm? Yes, you said so, but I said I would do that farm work immediately I return from school. So today is our quiz. Okay, I said so. And you decide to take the decision on your own. Come on, go and drop that bag and go to the farm for me. Uh uh. Mama, she says she will go when she comes back. Will you shut up and go to school? Ah, Baka. Ah. Ijim, what are you still doing here? You've not gone to school. I'm leaving now. Did you hear what Mama is saying? Ah. What did she say? That will go, she's not going to school. Uh huh. And how is that my business? Come, let's go. Let's go to school. Lawyer. Come on, can we go? You rock all day. Go to school. Me, me, I'm not going anywhere. Beat me. I'm not going anywhere. Me, Come on, can me, me. Since you go to not going anywhere, eh, I'm not going anywhere. I'm going back to the house. You better start going to school now. Okay. Hey, Choma. Hey, Choma. <laughs> Look at this girl. Go to school. You go shut up. Go and go inside and Look at me, my mates are no longer in the school now. Please let me finish now, begging you. Okay. Please, please, please. Why you finish crying? You go to the farm. It's your mama. It's your mama who take money for me. Mm -hmm. hey. I'm tired and I'm thirsty. I need to rest. Hey. Is the water still remaining? Yes. Still there. You got one more. Hey. Oh. So the phone is just too much. Nah. You yeah, are drugable. Hey. Come on, me. Ugo, come and rest now. Must you finish this work today? You could be as weak. Yes, so I must finish it. So I can be able to go to school tomorrow. You saw what happened this morning. I missed my quiz. I don't want to miss it again tomorrow. And I don't want what happened this morning to repeat itself again. I don't have strength for your mother, please. Ugo, this is exactly what I'm saying. Go to think of it. You're not the only person in that house. Josephine is there. I myself is there too. Why are you the only one that my mother stopped from going to school and asked you to come and work in this farm alone? Look at the time that we are here. And Josephine is in school. Suppose I did not come here with you, so you'll be the only one walking here all alone. What if all these village boys that are gallivanting around come here and they rape you? What will you do? Eh? Now tell me, what did you do to them? I want to know. Please. I've done nothing to them. You can bear me witness. You and I know that I've done nothing wrong to your parents. They just hate me for no just cause. And all this started when... When my parents died, I don't want to talk about it. All I want to do right now is to finish this work so I can be able to go to school tomorrow. I don't want to keep repeating class. I don't want to keep repeating class. I've repeated so much and it's not good. Look at me. I'm still in secondary school. I'm supposed to be in the university by now. Please, let's just forget about everything and work. Please. Because if you're tired, don't worry. Relax. Let me continue with the work. I must finish it today. I made 1,900 naira. Your own is 1,750 naira. Well, 
I thank God for today. At least today I didn't go in vain. What do you mean by well, you thank God for today? My brother, you should be grateful. It's not easy to make money. Look man. at it. Did I tell you I'm not happy? I said I thank God for today. Is that a wrong statement? The way you are presenting it, uh, I thank God. I won't concern you. Some people are even desperate for 500 uh, years. You are here at the Sunday if you don't have money. Thank you. Uh -huh. See, I want to tell you something. Uh, so, what is it? You are truly a friend. Since I came into this village, you've been um, more like a brother to me. You've been showing me love, you accommodated me, you've been, in fact, you are my brother. I really appreciate. Chimobi, is that why you're bothering yourself? What are friends for? See, immediately I saw you enter this village. My mind told me that you're a good person. And even up till now, I still see you as a good person. That's my point. It's not easy to accommodate a total stranger. So you showed me love, I appreciate. Secondly, I want to tell you that I've gotten my own one room. Somewhere around. Your what? One room. Tell me why? Why would you go and look for your own house elsewhere? When you know my own house is still vacant for you any day, any time. See, if I offended you in any way, you're supposed to talk to me. Not for you to go and look for your own house elsewhere. Would you go and waste that type of money? No, you know? no, 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 no. My brother, we are still in order. Trust me. I appreciate the fact that you want us to be together. Fine and good. But I am a man. I need to start up. At, okay, now think of it. I have siblings. I have parents. They might come visit me someday. And I won't bring them to your old room. So I need my old room. Please. Yeah? So please, we are in order, but I need to have my own room. Okay? Well, it's okay. Uh, I understand you. Okay, no problem. I'm happy for you. Uh, congratulations anyway. Thank you. <laughs> but we must launch your new house. Oh. Launch what? It. Launch what? Launch yeah. more new. That one concerns We must celebrate it. Oh. Yeah, we have to feel it. That one concerns you. We must launch it. And Don't I must pray for it. Don't mock me. We have to feel it. Don't have us. Don't have to get it. That's why I see you. Yeah, the roof is big. Oh. Ha. How are you going to furnish this house? I mean, buying up bed, DVD, phone, and all that. So many things. My brother, I used to go down to Buenaca. I know, I know, I know. The good news is that I now have my own room. As a furnishing, the room will furnish itself. <laughs> ah. Well, that is true anyway. I'm happy for you. Mm. But, I must drink for it. My one bottle. Must take my one bottle. Must you drink? Uh -huh. Must you drink? It's a new thing. We are celebrating it. You must drink for it, of course. You want to drink a cup before you? If I now buy a house, what do you drink? You don't use your drink. Eh? You don't want to come here. Close here. You are okay, my friend. If you want water, it's not a drink. Take your time, my friend. 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 Mama, you're not looking happy. What is it? Mama, I'm not happy at all. You are not happy? Yes, Papa. Ijoma, why are you not happy? Papa, Mama, I want to ask, what did the go to do to you and Josephine that made you hate her like this? What has she done? I want to understand. Because nothing she does in this house pleases any of you. Is it because of this nonsense? You are looking so moody. Mama, my question is not nonsense. Oh. I need to know, please. It's okay. I think I'll tell her. My daughter, I will tell you. Hmm? Now you listen. In matters like this, you are still a very small girl. But since you insist and you want to know, I don't mind, I'll tell you. You see, Ugochi's late father was my elder brother. He was a very, very wicked man when he was alive. 
He refused to give me my own share of the family land on property. Even when I pleaded with him to give me my own land so that I can sell it and help myself. He still refused. It became very clear to me that he never wanted anything good for me. When I wanted to marry a mother here, I never had a dime. I know what I suffered. I know the hell I went through to raise money so that I can do the necessary marital things on your mother said. But as God may have it, he was coming back from an occasion with the wife when he had an accident and both of them died. And since then I decided I must pay him back in his coins by dealing with his own children. That is exactly what I'm doing now. And I don't think I'll stop until I am satisfied. Papa, do you know you're not a nice person? All those things you just narrated now, how does it concern Ugochi and her brother? Is there enough reason for you to be treating them like this? Papa, it's not fair now. Look at the little Onyebuchi. He's supposed to be in school now. You sent him to go and learn a, a, a motor mechanic. Papa, is it fair? Okay, early this morning, we are prepared to go to school. Mama asked to go to, to go back and drop her school bag and go to the farm. At her age, she's in a secondary school. Papa, all these things has to stop. Oh. And to you, Sister Josephine, you should remember that Sister Ogochi is a young girl like you. And a sister too. Nobody knows tomorrow. Who will you meet you? Who will you meet you? Will you shut up there? All right, all right. I think this discussion is over now. Papa? You're not saying anything. Mama, please, 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 please. What is it? Don't ever call me again. <laughs> Reverend Sister Ijama. So it is because of this nonsense he just ranted here that made you to call us all out here at this time of the night. Huh? I can see that you have started to grow wings. Don't worry. I know what to do. You can go to bed now. I'm not ready to go to bed. I said go to bed. Good night. Mama. Sister Josephine. God is watching the two of you. I heard everything. I heard everything that your father said. So your father is happy. He's happy that my parents are dead. Why? What wrong have we ever done to him in this house? What? Is that why he treats my brother and I like we are outcasts? Even if my late parents offended him, did Onyebuchi and I ever do anything to him? Have we ever done anything wrong to him? Did we? Please stop crying. Hmm? Even if everybody in this house hates you, I, Ijoma, is solidly behind you. Anything anybody wants in this house, I shall give them double. No, 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 please, Ijoma. It has not gotten to that. 
My head is full already. I don't want any more problem in this house like the one that is already happening. I don't want. They are your parents. And just finish your elder sister. And you're my sister too. I know, but but they don't know that. There is no but in this issue. Hmm? Just leave them. As we any nan nyan won si buzi eh. Eh? Please. Is just stop crying. It's okay now. Stop crying. It's okay. It's okay. It's been just what it is. Hmm? Okay, have you eaten? So hungry. You're not hungry. Okay. Hmm? I'm going to get food for you now. Ah uh ah. -uh. What you kill yourself because of these people? I'm going to let me go and get it for you. You must eat. Uh-uh. Mm. Mama. 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 Why do you have to leave us like this? Why do you have to leave so early for us to suffer like this in this world? <laughs> Why are you walking under the rain? Ibu Mule Alolo, or Mike? Eh? Timothy, it's not that I'm power Mike or anything. I know it's running, yes. But see, I, I need money. You need money. Let's go and walk. You need enough money. You need money. If you don't need money, yet, whether I don't know rain, let the rain fall from now to tomorrow. I'll walk. I need money. I need enough money. That's you. I need money, fine and good, but my health is more important. My waist is spending me. This, 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 this world is too stressful. It's too stressful. Ah, uh, my waist is spending me. Oh, <coughs> Ugochi! Uncle! Oh, good afternoon. Why are you coming back home at this time of the day? Eh? Gochi, why are you not in school? Uncle, I was sent out of school because... because I've not paid my school fees. Gochi, in that case, there is no cause for alarm. Hmm? That means you have to be in the house. Go in there. Drop your bag and join my wife at the farm. Uncle, please, please help me and pay my fees. I'm begging you. You have paid for Josephine and, and the drama. Please, I don't want to stay at home, please. Yes, because they are my own children. Gosh, are you my child? Did I give birth to you? Uncle, but you are my uncle. I am your late brother's daughter. Thank God. You have said it with your own mouth. My late brother's daughter. If you want to remain in school, 
go out there, make the money, and pay your school fees, or forget everything about school. Uku, Uku, please don't do this to me. Ugo, check. Please give me a break. Give me a break. Now leave my presence. Uku, please. Leave my presence. Go and wake your useless father from the grave. Come and pay your school fees. Idiot. Also, Jehu. They will never learn my trouble. Hello? No, eh, on you with you. Uh, it's me, Ugochi, your sister. No, it's not my phone. I'm calling you with Uju's phone. Onyebuchi, there's a problem, oh. It's uncle. He, he, he has stopped me from schooling. He said he doesn't have money to, to pay for my school fees anymore. I don't know. I don't know. I didn't do anything to him. No, no, see, I'm not telling you this for you to worry yourself. I'm only telling you for you to know the situation of things in the house. I hope you are learning your work. You are concentrating. Please just concentrate for me, Biko. Since he doesn't want to train you in school, so that you have something to hold on to. I know. Don't worry. Don't worry. I will, I will keep calling you with this number. No, don't, don't do that. Don't cry. I'll call you. I'll call you. Very wicked. What is wrong with him? So what are you going to do now? I don't know, honestly. This is how my uncle behaves all the time. I don't know what I've done wrong to him. Just take a good look at me. Am I supposed to be in secondary school at my age? When my mates are in the university? Because of what my uncle is doing to me. Is it fair? We definitely pass through this space, you know. Let me see you. Sorry, oh. Oye Gucci. Oye Gucci. Oye Gucci. Why are you sitting down here? Have you finished the work or got asked you to do in that truck? Honestly, I'm confused. I don't know what I'm doing again. <laughs> I can't just concentrate anymore. How? I don't understand. What happened? My sister is going to just go there right now. Not my uncle, I just don't pay your school fees. Why is he doing that? I don't know. I can't just tell. Since my parents died, I and my sister have been passing through here in that house. Now look at me, a boy of my age, learning mechanic. Why my mate are in the school doing well? <laughs> And my uncle must me to do this. Okay. So, I will advise you to learn this mechanic well. Look around this country today. Every good mechanic is earning big money. He's living fine. He's a comfortable man. If your uncle sending you to Lemo, motor mechanic just to wicked you i want you to prove him wrong you hear you have to understand understand that it's okay it's okay go back to work yeah is okay? yeah
Ja, kom. 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 Asked us to leave because we have not bought the new school uniform and we've not paid our fees. I, I pleaded with him. I, I begged him. I even laid down on the floor that I was going to pay later, and he refused. He sent us out of the class, so I had to come back. And what did Papa say when you returned home? Your father said I have to stop schooling. I can no longer pay my fees. But if I insist that I want to school, then I will have to take care of my fees by myself. Are you serious? My father said that. Yes. Uguchi, are you sure? What do you mean, am I sure? Will I lie against your father? You can ask him. You can ask him. Why? Yeah, but... Why do you have to wash your dirty clothes and left mine, knowing that they are equally dirty. Why? Are you alright? What kind of approach is that? <laughs> Am I alright? Is it that you're deaf? Or do I have water in my mouth that you did not hear me clearer? Now let me rephrase. I said, why did you leave my dirty clothes and washed only your stinking clothes? Wait! Let me ask you, when did it become Mogochi's duty to wash your dirty clothes? Can't you wash your clothes? Yeah? Pijama. Oh, I'm just a thing. Your elder sister that you're talking to like that. I am going to squeeze you. You may go say. Because I can see you don't have respect for me anymore. Huh? Respect. You should respect yourself before looking for someone to respect you. Can't you do your laundry? Give me, give me. Oh, now I see that both of you plan this. Now watch me. Don't do that, stop it, don't do that. Don't, 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 what you just did, you will never go away with it. You will not. What is going on here? What is going on? Mama, yeah. have you seen what Josephine did to Gochi's clothes? All because Sugochi refused to wash her, 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 her dirty clothes. And so what is wrong in my daughter Josephine asking her to wash her clothes? Oh, Mama. is that why people are here making noise? Mama, oh, please. Like you, I am going to Please just your mouth. You cannot do anything. Oh yeah, twist it. Twist my lips. You. Oh, okay. So, Ugo, you said you wanted to tell me something. This is it. Which one? You know you're the closest person to me in this house. And for that singular reason, I cannot do anything without letting you know. Since your father my uncle has refused to to train me in school i cannot be seated doing nothing so i i have decided to start up something no matter how small i need to start up something that will be giving me money so i can be able to pay my fees hey John, i need to go to school i need to oh my god so, what do you want to start? And the money to even start it with? I already spoke with my friend, Uju. I pleaded with her to lend me some money so I can start up grammar business. I don't mind to hawk. I mean, if that's the only solution for me to go back to school, then I will. 
I need to make my late parents proud. My brother is already serving somewhere as a mechanic. I don't need to be a school dropout. I must go to school. So, would you be a nice person? She has already given me the money. So, oh. I, I will start. Mm -hmm. She's such a nice person. May God bless her. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I want you to do something for me. Hmm? I want you to stop thinking about what my parents and Josephine are doing to you in this house. I strongly believe that one day God will wipe away your tears and you'll forever be happy. Oh? Please, I that too. just wipe your tears. Hmm? I don't even know how to thank you. I don't know how to thank you for everything you have done for me in this house. You are, you are everything to me. Thank you for your love, your your care, your encouragement. I mean, without you in this house, I would have committed suicide. It's okay. Your happiness is my concern. Hmm? So, when are you starting the business? Okay, um, hopefully next week. I, I think I will start up something. Wow. Thank God. Hmm? I'm happy for you. So, can we go to bed now? I just want to be alone. I need to receive some fresh air before coming inside. You can go. Are you sure? Please. Okay. Well, before then, you need to wipe away your tears. I'm no longer crying. I'm fine. And put a smile on your face. Hmm? Thank All you. All right. Don't be too long, go. There is something about that year. Who could she be? So she's crying all the time. Life is misery daily. And she's so lonely. So she's crying all the time. Father, we thank you. We worship you. Thank you for providing the resource for this business. Thank you for the hand that made it come to pass. Father, I, I commit my sister into your holy hand. At, that as she goes out, she will make profit and customers will locate her. Amen. So that at the end of the day, Amen. your name and your name alone will be exalted. Amen. Thank you, Father, for the Jesus name we pray. Amen. My passport. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> Josephine, Josephine, why did you pack that quantity of granite? You know that today is my first day of starting this business. Don't you want me to make profit? And so what? Ijoma, Sister Josephine, can you return this granite back, back from where you, to where you collected them from? Uh uh. Why will you pack this quantity of granite? If it's like this, how much do you think she will make by the end of the day? What is wrong with you now? This is not good, Jama. Sister! Papa! This is not fair. Mama! Yeah. This is not fair. Oh! 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 And tell her to drop all, all the granots she, she, she packed from Ugochi's, Ugochi's granots. And so, what is wrong if Josephine packed some granots from Ugochi's granots? Oh, Mama, ask her. Ask her. So, this is why you people are making this kind of noise in my house. Eh? Now, will both of you go to school? Go to school! Papa, even you! 
for me. Let me even see how this works. Of course, even if I tell you another uncle. Even if I tell you another uncle. Uncle. Uncle, this thing you people are doing to me in this house is no good, though. It's no good. Do you know the quantity of ground you just collected? Do you know how much? I'm starting this business for the very first time. How do you want me to progress? Oh, how much, eh? So you want us to pay for this small granite we took? Mama? What is wrong if she asks you to pay for the granite you collected? Don't you know this is someone's business? It's okay. No problem. No problem at all. Let's go. We'll pay for the granite. You want us to pay for the granite? But mind you, but from today onwards, you will pay for every food you eat in this house. No. I assure you. No, no, no. I assure no, you. No, no, Uncle, please don't pay no. for the granite again. I'll manage. I'll manage. Don't worry. Don't pay. Papa, this is not fair. Oh. This is not I fair at all. Come on, go to school. Oh, boss, leave Your friend has gone, though. No, mind him. Okay. Okay. My son, you said your name is Pascal. Yes, I'm here. And you want to marry one of my daughters? Yes, I'm here. You are welcome. What of your father? Is he still alive? Yes, I'm here. But he went to my younger sister's place at Jones. He went to see my younger sister and my husband. Then I decided to come and make my interest known to this family. Then, any time he comes back, we'll come and pick up a date mm -hmm. for a traditional wedding song. I see. So, which of my daughters do you want to marry? We'll go to now. We'll go. We'll go to that one. It's, no, it's a no-gay area. Besides, she's not my daughter. She is my late elder brother's daughter. Now all I know is that I love Ugo and she is the person that I'm here to marry. I love her, I want to marry her. Do you know her before now? Have you seen her anywhere? No, my. But the person that directed me here told me that she's a good girl. And people have been saying good about her. Honestly, you don't know that girl. You don't know Ugo at all. Moreover, the person or persons that directed you, hmm, they do not know her very well. If you know that girl, my son, you will not have anything to do with her. Besides, Ugochi's father, that is my elder brother, before he died, left a very strict instruction and said that Ugochi should not get married. Because 
my late brother, the father, had only a male child. And she wants to go to stay in the house and bear more children. Moreover, anybody that tries to marry her will not live to see the next day. Hey, now what do I do now? I want to marry that we are Now husband. you are talking. I like you. I'll give you one of my good daughters to marry. Hmm? Um, Joe. Josephine. Yes, Papa. Please come. And um, greet our guest. You're welcome. Thank you very much. This young man here is Pascal by name. He said he wants to marry you. So, would you like to marry him? Yes, Papa, will marry him. If it is the will of God. Oh, I won't want to know why you go. My son, if I you can go back. Hmm? <laughs> hey! What's the name of what you just did? I don't understand. What are you talking about? You don't understand. Okay. Since you have foolishly lost your conscience, I will tell you. That guy that came to uh, seek for Gucci's hand in marriage, and Papa told him all the bad things, which the girl did, did not even do. And you foolishly accepted to marry him. Why? Yeah, don't tell me you're this desperate by snatching your sister's suit up. So say, what is wrong with you? Why would you do a thing like that? Me, Jojo. Is it me, Josephine, your elder sister, that you're talking to like that? Ijo, are you mad? So, you don't have respect for your seniors anymore. Don't you have respect for me? Respect. I should respect you. You first of all respect yourself. By going to tell Papa to send a message to that fool that you're no longer interested in that marriage. Ijoma, is it my husband that you're referring to as a fool? Huh? Your husband. Did I say your uh, um, husband? A man who has not even paid your bride price. He has not done your traditional marriage. And you're here calling him your husband. Ah, I never knew you were this desperate. I don't blame you. Amosu! I knew it. I know you never wanted anything good for me. Well, Gucci, how is it? It's alright, I'm fine. I heard you talking to your sister about the marriage issue. You shouldn't be bothering yourself over nothing. That man is not my husband. Okay? If your sister wants to go ahead and marry him, then she can continue. Besides, marriage is not my problem for now. Gucci, what kind of a human being are you? You take everything so simple. Because life itself should be simple. Come and help me select my granules, please. Okay. Get a seat now. Get a seat.
what is the meaning of this unexpected gathering? Huh? By the way, who called this meeting? Papa, I did. You did? Yes, Papa. So, what is the meeting all about? Ijoma, I am seated now and I am all ears. So, talk to me. Papa, I could not sleep last night. Why? Papa, someone came here yesterday asking for Gochis and the marriage. And I was inside when I heard everything you said and how you tarnished to Gochis image before the man just to achieve your aim. Even swapping Ugochi with Josephine. Papa, why? Hey, Joma, is this your reason for this unprecedented meeting? Yes, Papa. And I want you to tell us your reasons. Hey, just hold it there. You should have asked Papa to explain the reason to you and not to us. Because I know that Papa had a reason why he did what he did. By the way, who are you to ask Papa that kind of question? Sister Josephine, please. Do not tell me anything because I can't remember referring to you. I only asked Papa a question and I need an answer. Ask who? Ask for the mess why I'm here. Uh, both of you stop that. Stop that. In your man. Papa. Let me ask you. When will you learn to be wise? I ask you again. Will you be happy if Ugochi, another man's daughter, gets married in this house before your own very elder sister? Papa. Answer him. Papa, yeah? point of correction, please. Ugochi is not another man's daughter. Ugochi is your late elder brother's daughter. So automatically, she is your daughter now. Ijoma, you have said it all now. Hmm? You have said it all. Ugochi is my late elder brother's daughter mm -hmm. and not my own daughter. So get that clear into your empty head. Anyway, I have done what I want to do and no going back. I think this discussion is over. Papa! Hmm? Come. John. Why are you so stupid? To the extent that you are so jealous of your own sister's progress. Eh? Mama, I am not jealous of anybody. All I'm saying is that, is that I don't like the way you are treating Ugochi like an outcast in this house. It's not fair. Hmm. Oh. <laughs> Tell me what I did to each other. My own blood sister. Josephine. That please. she is always fighting me in my own father's house. Josephine, don't mind her, okay? Don't mind her. Are you sure this girl is my sister? Are you truly sure? Josephine. Please, stop stressing yourself over each other. When my parents were alive, my father was having issues with his, his elder brother over a land dispute, which was not settled till my father went for a traditional marriage with my mother at the neighboring village. On their way back, the vehicle they entered had a terrible accident and everyone in the vehicle died, including my parents. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry about that. Ever since then, my uncle has been treating my younger brother and I like slaves. 
in the same house that my father built before he died. <laughs> he doesn't take care of us at all. You can imagine my younger brother that is not up to 15 years has been sent to learn mechanic at his age. <laughs> and me, at my age, I'm still in secondary school. <laughs> because he doesn't allow me to go to school often. I keep repeating class. I keep repeating class. So, why are you not in school? I mean, is this what you do for a living? My, my uncle insisted that if I must continue schooling, then I will be the one to make the money and pay my fees. That he will not take care of my fees anymore. So, I, I met with my friend Ujuma. I pleaded with her, so she gave me some money. That was how I started this granite business. To see if I can, I can raise some money and pay my fees. I really need to go back to school. Okay. What can she do? Where will she go? Oh, she's crying all the time. Life is misery. She's so lonely, so she's crying all the time. Sorrows and tears, the pain is so hard to bear. So she's crying all the time. Life is misery. I was with Ugochi today, and she told me how her uncle has been maltreating her. That man has been so wicked to her, to the extent of sending her only younger brother out to learn mechanic. Imagine. Can you, as in there? Hush. Well, it's not a news in this village. A lot of people in this village know Mazuzoka is a very wicked man. So, well, well, that is by the way. So, what do you want to do now? I like that girl. You like the girl? Well, since you like the girl, then go for her now. She's a nice girl. Well, I don't know if she will look at your face so, or even come close to you because since I know that girl in this village, I've never seen her with any man. Well, you can try your luck. I greet you, sir. Yes. Who are you? What can I do for you? My name is Chimobi. I'm here to see you, coach. Chimobi. Yes, sir. You want to see Ugochi? Yes, sir. What for? What do you want her to do for you? Well, she is my customer. She normally brings granite to our site. Mm. Ugochi! Ugochi! Uncle! Please come. I'm here. This young man wants to see you. Uh, uh, good afternoon. Ugochi, how are you? I'm alright. Who, who is the young man? Who is he? Okay, he's my customer. He normally buys granite from me. Mm. This one you came to our house today. I hope all is well. All is well. I'm just here to inform you that tomorrow we will be needing enough granite eh? at our site. Really? Hey! <laughs> Thank you very much. I sincerely appreciate it. I will be there. I will be there. Right. God bless you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Take care, sir. Hey! Tomorrow will be a very good day for me. <laughs> uh, good you. Uh, are you sure it's only granite this young man buys from you? Or is there any other strings attached? Uh, Uncle, I don't understand you. He's only my customer, nothing else. You don't understand me? Yes. Okay. I'm watching. Hmm? I don't understand, but I'm watching. Are you saying that you like me and 
you would want me to be your girlfriend. Ugochi, like is an understatement. I love you. I can't do without you. I, I dream you, I eat you, I wake up thinking about you. Please, accept me and make me the happiest man on earth. Well, I can only accept on one condition. Any condition is acceptable, please. I will be your girlfriend, but no sex. Because I have never done it before. Yes. Huh? You mean you're a virgin? Hey, even not on you can come from you can. You're a virgin. Ha! That makes it more interesting. I don't, I'm not addicted to sex. Fine, okay by me. Yes. Yeah, no, why not? Accepted. Accepted. That's no problem. It's alright. Yes, so I'm not even addicted to sex. <laughs> yes, so it's okay by me. Accepted with my whole heart. Sorry. You are very funny. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you very much. It's alright. You know you have been eating my granite, so you buy everything. I will pay for even the tree. Don't worry. <laughs> I'll pay I'll buy everything. You are very funny. I like you because Sorry. of that. <laughs> can I can I can I get a hug? No. Just a hug. Let's celebrate this victory. Eh? We just opened a new page. <laughs> just a hug. Sorry. Since I know you in this village, this is the first time you're buying beer. Mm -hmm. The reason is simple. I'm happy. You're happy. You're always happy. But I wonder why today's one is different. Okay. You okay. must know. Okay. Ugochi has accepted to be my girlfriend. Are you serious? I am. Oh boy, you're lucky. Wow. And the interesting part is, uh -huh. she said that we are not going to let you know because she's a bitch. Uh -uh. What kind of friendship is that? How can a relationship last long without sex? Nako, <laughs> nako. That makes it more interesting. Because I will end up marrying her as a virgin. Are you no good? Hey, I'm going to play the ball. You know what? I'm talking of marriage. Oh, you think marriage is just to go and carry women and put in the house? Nah, she's your uncle. Okay. See, let me tell you the rules and regulations in marriage. Okay. You must make sure you provide for her, feed her well, clothe her, put her in a comfortable place with other amenities to make her happy. For your own case, she she, she she, you don't have. Don't you, your house is empty. You don't have DVD, no foam, no cutting, no television, no fridge. It's also new take it. allow. Nothing. You don't have anything. Marriage commissioner, are mm. you done? I'm done. Let me tell you what you don't know. Mm, tell me. True love conquers it all. Eh. When we get to that bridge, we shall cross it. I get cross, yeah. The most important thing is that she has accepted to be my girlfriend. That's what we are celebrating. So, mind what you say to put that girl. Yeah. 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 This is where you married to buy. Poor boy, like this is where you married to buy. That lie, you can't try it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, with well, that life will. Where is everybody? I met no one at home when I arrived. Why have you not filled those jars at the backyard with water? Don't you know that my husband and his people will be coming in a few days' time to take me? Josephine, how can you talk like that? Were you not here in the morning when I went out to hawk? And I came back not quite long. And you expect me to feel those drums? So I am talking to you. And you have the God to talk back to me. Well, I know what your problem is. You are jealous of me because I am getting married. Hey, please, Josephine, don't be funny. I, 
Uguchi. Jealous of you. Over what? You are. In fact, Ugochi, I don't just have your time. Leave all these things you are doing. Pack all the buckets and the gallons. Go to the stream and fill all the drums. Do you hear me? Going to the stream to fetch water, I don't have issues with that. But filling those drums, I can't. Don't you know that I'm a human? I went out to hawk. It's not easy. How do I tell me to fill the drum? So I am talking and you are talking back with me, even in anger. What is my business about you going to work? Eh? I can't see. <coughs> Idiots! Don't go and fill those drums today and you will see what I will do to you. Just fail! That is the story. Ugochi is not available. But since you people decided to marry from my family, I have another of my beautiful daughter that will suit your son so much for a wife. Let him hold the car fits wear it. All right. Can we see her? Why not? She's inside. Um. Ijoma. Ijoma. Papa. Please come. Papa, I'm here. Yes, my daughter. Greet our visitors. Welcome, sir. Welcome. Uh, this is Ichi Ibeba. And beside him is his son, Amichi. They came to ask for a hand in marriage. What do you have to say? Marry me. Yes. Papa, let me ask you something. When did my name become Ugochi? I was inside when I overheard them telling you that they came to marry Ugochi. And all the lies you told them about her. Papa, why? Why are you doing all this? Why did you hate to go to so much? Is this where your wickedness has gotten to? Eh, hey, Papa? The first people came. You gave Josephine to them. And now these people are here for her again. And you want to do the same thing. Papa Ogene, why did you hate Ugochi so much? Eh, Papa? Please. I don't want you to call me out here next time and tell me this nonsense again. And as for two of you, you don't know what you came for. Hmm? By the time I go inside and come out here again, I don't want to see two of you again. Makana me uniwe, uwa me linasa, una yara kochia. Ndo go futu na aftawa. Dama. Come here, Joma. What was the meaning of what you have just done? Mama, what I just did? Yes. Mama, I don't understand. What did I do? 
What do you mean you don't understand? Why did you talk to Papa in the manner you did in presence of our visitors? Hey, please, Sister Josephine. I wasn't talking to you. I was referring to it's you. It's the same thing. Answer her. Why did you reject the man that came to marry you and take me away? Why? May God have mercy on you people because you don't know what you're doing. Anyways, I don't have time for all this nonsense. And as for you, Sister Josephine, so you have the God to take away your blood sister's future and you want me, me, Joma, to do the same thing. I will never do that. And let me tell you, you must regret this. You must regret this. Ijoma. Ijoma. Is it me, Josephine? Your own elder sister that you're speaking to in this manner? Ijoma, I can see you no longer have respect or fear for anyone in this house. Don't worry. We shall see. See what? We shall see nothing. Ijoma. Ijoma, you go. Hey, why is it that if I'm planning something good for this family, Ijoma will be spoiling it with your Obanje character? Obanje, I don't want to see you Papa, I don't want that kind of planning at all. Because there's nothing good about it but evil. Papa, do you have conscience at all? You deprive the Gochi, your own blood brother's daughter from marrying the sister that came for her, for her hand in marriage and you said you're doing good for this family papa you are bringing curse to this family and i don't want to be part of it hey. come back here oh. come back here ijoma oh is it me you are walking out on me ijoma you are walking out on me your father hey just a few. Talk to your sister. Talk to your sister as I will. Please, 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 Papa. Please, Papa. Don't just involve me in Ijoma's case. Don't involve me in this rat's case because she's going to fight me as usual. Talk to Mama. She's still don't, don't, don't even mention my name. Tell your father to talk to her. She's also your daughter. Ajoma. Can I be much whereby I talk about Mara? Lizzie, you're out. Yes. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Fine, are you? I'm alright. Please, there is something I want to discuss with you. What's that? I hope there's no problem. Not really. It's about the suitor that came here yesterday. Please. I I want you to accept his proposal. Accept him, get married to him, so that all this quarrel with your parents will end. Will go. Please. Ugo. I woke up this morning very happy and excited and, and excited. Please. Why do you want to spoil it for me now? I don't want to spoil it for you. Ugo. The young man came for you and not for me. So if there's anybody in this house who should marry him, then that, that person should be you. Oh, well, he later changed his mind. Have you suddenly forgotten? He did. All I want is peace in this house. Ever since that man left this house, your mother has not allowed me to rest. Mikono, just accept his proposal so that everything will end. Ugo, if you don't want me to get upset throughout this week, can we stop this discussion now and forever? Biko, It's alright, if you insist. Better. Pop up. Pop up. Please, yeah. Hey, we'll go to Good afternoon. afternoon. How are you? I'm fine. Hey, you look so beautiful today. Thank you. You're welcome. Please, let's go in. 
let's go in. Listen, you have nothing to worry about, okay? No need to be afraid. You are safe. You know? You are welcome to my humble abode. Your heart is fine. Yes. Please don't mock me. Yes, it's, it's okay. <laughs> Not bad. Alright. What's the man for you? I don't want anything. No. Please, what's the man for you? Honestly, I'm fine. You don't look bright. What's bothering you? I don't know what I've done wrong to my uncle. I don't know. Whenever good thing wants to come my way, he looks for every possible means to block it. I don't know why. It's breaking my heart, honestly. So what happened? A few weeks back, someone came to ask for my hand in marriage. He told the person tales about me and pushed the man to his first daughter Josephine and the man married her. Just two days ago, another suitor came to ask for my hand in marriage again. He still did the same thing and pushed the man to Ijoma. It's just that Ijoma is a very nice person and she turned the man down. But even at that, I, I, it is not nice. I'm more happy about this and this is supposed to be my uncle, my father's brother. It's all right, calm down. That's what I call God's plan. I don't understand. I call it God's plan because all those things have been happening to you because of me. How do you mean? I want to marry you. Oh, please, I don't like it when you joke with me. I'm telling you things that are happening to me. I'm talking about marriage. I'm serious. I want to marry you. Uh -huh. Okay, fine. I know you're joking. Let's talk about something else. Have you eaten today? What did you cook? You have food in the house. In fact, I want to eat something now. I want to marry you. Chimobi! Chimobi, please! This is the first time I'm coming to you. I'll be making me shine now. I want to marry you. <laughs> After you. <laughs> so, Papa, we have to be on our way now. When Mama comes back, tell her that we came. Huh? It's alright, my daughter. <laughs> I'll do so, eh? Just uh, send my greetings to my mother in law. Tell her that the day that I comes back, I'll come and see her. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> my regards to her own parents, too, eh? Okay. Huh? I'll do. Um, one more thing. Please remind their father. Oh, remind them that they have not completed or even paid the dowry. Oh, I'm still waiting. I'll tell them. No time is later. Okay. I'll tell them. Careful. Right. Okay. This is you. I'm happy with you. Bye. Okay. I'm still waiting. what this kind of marriage is. Hmm? How can a girl pack all her belongings and move in with a man who has not paid her bride price? 
My sister is speechless. Your parents supported her. Maybe that's how they want it. But eh, it is a very shameful act. I'm so ashamed of her. Now, what up all about in your money? Eh? Go, guy, or try here, Biko. You know, the Gucci came to your house yesterday and you told her you want to marry her. Uh -uh. Of course not. She came to my house and I looked at her eyeball to eyeball and told her I want to marry her. <laughs> so what did she say? Uh, she looked at me and walked out. Meaning she accepted or what? I can't explain that reaction, but I love Gucci. If she says no to me, my brother, I will die. Okay. Let me ask you. What if she says yes? Are you going to bring her into that your empty room that you don't even have DVD, no television, not even a sound system to... What do you think will be keeping her happy in that house? Good. Let me tell you what you don't know. You see, true love conquers it all. When a woman truly loves you from her heart, she will stay with or without those things you mentioned. Uh, she's not after material things now. She will be. That one is before. Not girls of nowadays, you see. So many of them prefer those things even more than their husband. I'm telling you because it, it, it makes them happy more than their husband. I like the way you said it. Some of them. My Ugochi is exceptional. She will stay without material things. Yes. Even at that, you need to do something. Do something like what? My friend, you know what I'm talking about. I said, you just, have, just go to the market. Buy her DVD, television, everything. Buy her sound system. Yeah, 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 yeah. Make her happy. Well, you are not a child. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm telling you. I won't drop a bag because I want to drink. You don't have to do something about her. Yes, that's too much. Should I drop because I want to buy DVD? Okay. Too much. Okay. Hello. Hello. It's just that I'm, I'm worried. Worried about what? Someone asked that I should marry him. So I have been pondering over what we discussed. Marry him. Who is the person? Is he from this our village? No. His name is Chimobi. He's a stranger in this village. Though according to him, he, he said he's from Amma Avo community. And what did you tell him? Ah, I have not given him any answer yet. Though I like him. Are you serious? Yes. <laughs> is he a nice person? Well, from the little I have seen, he is nice. In that case, I would like to see him. And then I'll take you there. It's a much of that's what I've been here thinking about. I'm sorry I did not come to your room to discuss it with you. It's because of Josephine. I wouldn't want her to hear anything I want to talk to you about. I've told you to leave those people. Forget them. All I want is your happiness. Mm? So can we go inside now? <laughs> Good. How are you? I'm fine. Yeah, you're welcome. Let's go in now. Why are you people outside? No, don't worry yourself. Why not? Mm, that's my sister. I know her. <laughs> um, you don't have to worry. I've only come to tell you something. Hey, but let's go in now. Unlike you, why will you stay outside? 
You're fine here. Okay. If you insist, I'm all ears. Okay. I have come to tell you that I I have decided to marry you. Ugochi. Hmm? Please. Please and please. I hate pranks. I hate suspense. I hate jokes. I'm, Be serious. I'm not joking with you. I can't joke with such thing. I have decided to marry you. You will marry me? Yes. Hi, thank you. I like him and he looks very nice. He is. But my problem is that he is very poor. And I wonder how he will take care of you if he finally marries you. I know he is poor, but we love ourselves. The most important thing is love. And I know that God Almighty will provide for us when the time comes. I believe he has a bright future. Bright future? Yes. Ugo, how can you tell me that a stranger that left his own community and came to this village has a bright future? Doing all this messing, all these minor jobs, uh, going all, uh, for all this uh, farm work has a bright future. Who go to God the choir? Chim dear. The thing is that love is involved. And God also. I know God will provide for him. I have the strong feeling that he has a bright future. It's not about today. It's about tomorrow. Hmm? Let's forget about this problem. Just yeah. wish me well. God's <laughs> <laughs> so tell me, where did you learn how to cook granite? Because this year granite is special and sweet. Uh, uh, what makes it special? Mm. Because you cooked it yourself. This stuff. <laughs> that reminds me, have you given up on school? No. How can I give up on school? It's just that I've not really made enough money to pay my fees. This business is not really lucrative. I just make some small gain from it and it's not enough to pay my fees. So, oh, if, no, so if you see money now, you will go back to school? Yes, I will. I really want to be a graduate. There's no graduate in my family. Don't worry. I've saved up little money from the little money I will do something like that. Really? Mm -hmm. I will be the happiest girl on earth. Thank you so much. <laughs> but I really have to be on my way because I have chores to take care of at home. No, 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 no. Wait now. I'm enjoying our conversation. I know, but I will give you granite. I know that's what you really want. No, I want you not granite. <laughs> hey, you won't let them, huh? Hey. Is that one finished? Yes, sir. I'll take. Mm -hmm. But you'll pay, oh. <laughs> I will pay. You'll pay. I will pay. Anyway, I trust you. You don't owe me. Yes, sir. <laughs> What is the meaning of what you just did? What did I do? Hold on, Jokwan. You don't know what you did. Ugochi, how can you step so low to fall in love with this poor stranger that has nothing to show for than going to different building, carrying block and serving medicine? Uh-uh, you're too beautiful for that. So yeah. when has it become your business on whom I've chosen to be friends with? When? I am very, very disappointed. Do you know why? Huh? Because you don't know how endowed you are. Mm. Eh? So of all the men in this village, if it's this thing that just left now, eh, that you decided to fall in love with. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Don't call him a thing. And don't shut me up. You don't have that right. Oh. What do you mean that thing? Eh? Are you the one that is going to tell me who I'll be friends with? Okay. But Ogochi, I saw everything. 
Oh, go check, stop the hugging. To kiss him, ah, everything. I, I did not kiss anybody. I only amazing. hugged him. Bia, Amaka, what is it? Agatha. What is your problem with the way Ugochi lives her life? Oh. Obasarun? Yes, because she's our friend. Really? Mm-hmm. A special advisor on love matters, sorry. What I am trying to say is that Ugochi, our friend here, is too endowed for that thing that just left. I said, Ugochi, I'm not coming now. Special advisor. Oh, no, I'm a messy. Why do you believe him people? You don't know tomorrow. Why are you calling him names like that? I don't like it though. He's my friend. I don't like when you insult my friend. I don't like it. Ogochi, the only thing I want to tell you now is that Nanda Bansi me tone the men in Makageni or no no Iwata. That guy go no no messy him man. I'm only for zone. Me na buri buri blocks from one building to the other. What about your your boyfriend? What does he do? I don't know. You don't know. He's better than him. Eh. Uh, what is your business in her matter? Where is Angurogu in her own case? Mm. Yes. I think she should make a right choice. What should you do? Why? Let's do. 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 let us do let us do let us <laughs> Greetings, my prince. Excuse me. All right, I will quite excuse you. How are you, beautiful angel? Please, I'm not your angel. Who are you calling your angel? I don't know why you men like to be insulted before you know that someone does not want you. Well, let me tell you, uh, you definitely need my attention. You definitely do. Please, whatever you want to say to me, you have to be fast about it. Mm. My boyfriend is waiting. You call that uh, Richard looking guy your boyfriend. Anyway, don't worry. Let me show you something. Hold on. Driver. Yes, my boy. Have it. And what is it that you bought from me that you want to pay for? What? Actually, I didn't buy anything from you, but I just want you to have this. Take care of yourself. You know you're beautiful. You look good. I want you to take this money to shop yourself. You know, just for a start. Just do something good with the money. I like you and I want to, you know, be close to you and make you this girl that everyone will want to be in the village. Now Take listen to me. And leave this wretched boy. If this is an insult, you better stop it. I never came to you to tell you that I need money. I am not one of these cheap village girls that go around begging for money. I never asked for your money. And this is going to be the very last time you will stop me on the way to insult me. Do you understand that? Nonsense. Prince, my foot. Nonsense. What did you say? Call that wretched looking guy your boyfriend. What boyfriend are you talking about? This guy doesn't actually know. What's nonsense? Money is long. Yes. Do this now, no matter what. Adaju, adaju. Give me the money, I will, I will give her. So, are you sure you can 
talk to her for me? Talking to her is my business already. I will talk to her. <laughs> on your behalf. I like this guy. <laughs> he knows what money is. <laughs> yes, thank you. Thank you. Good boy. <laughs> Good boy. Good boy. I love the guy. Come on, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Now, go wait, go go tell you go do wait. <laughs> wait now, relax. What do you mean wait now? Is this how much you love me? Is this how much you claim to love me? How do you expect me to collect this money? Tomorrow you say you love me. Yet you want me to, to take this money? You want to sell the love we share because of money? It's not like that. I'm doing this for your own good. Yes. How, how do you mean? Fine. You need money. You need to go back to school. I don't have. So use this money. I will handle it later. Please. I know I don't have and you don't have. So why would you collect this huge amount of money from the prince, a man that I don't like? Talk more of love. What if he comes back tomorrow and says I should give him the money he gave us? How do I pay it back? That's my point. We need this money for now. Use it. When that time comes, I will handle it. When that time comes, you say? Yes. Okay, I, I can handle it. When the time comes, I promise you can handle it. It's only big No, you need it. Whatever comes out of it, I will handle it. Please. The most important thing is that you need to go back to school. You need to take good care of yourself. Please, oh, I won't deceive you now. I'll be calm. Choose that this money is big. Don't worry. I don't want you to get it for us. Nothing will happen to you. <laughs> uh, where are you putting the money? I don't want my aunt to see it. That place will burn the money. Here. No! <laughs> my sister, I'm so happy. So very happy. To go one name. Mm. So you mean all these things happened today? Yes, so <laughs> and Tim will be collected the money from the prince mm. and gave to you. Honestly, I'm so, still very shocked. So, how will you pay back? That was exactly the question I asked him when he gave me the money, and he said that he will handle it when the time comes. So, handle it? Yes. How? I have no idea. My happiness is that I will be starting school tomorrow. So you'll be going back to school? Yes, that is why I'm washing my uniform. Ah, you don't know how happy I am. Oh. Mm. I've missed school. I've missed school so much. Hey, Obini, I can't be one anymore. Eh? Oh, go. I'm still worried. Over what? I don't want you to get into trouble. No, my sister, don't worry yourself. I will never get into trouble. After all, I wasn't the person that collected the money from the so-called prince. So I'm fine, don't worry yourself. Just help me get water, let me rinse my uniform. The sun is shining bright for you. Wipe your tears, everything is alright now. Forget the past. Oh. Where do you think you're going? I'm going to school. Yes. Have you paid your school fees? Yes. Nine. Zero. Ugochi said she has paid for her school fees. Did you give her money to pay for her school fees? No, Papa. No. Papa, no, Chicha, me libe bolu ke konako. So, Gochi, where did you get money to pay for your school fees? Because I cannot remember giving you any. Mama, what is it? Why are you waiting our time? Can't you see we are already, already, already late for school? Okay, you insist to know. She used the money she made from her um, granite business to pay for her school fees. Granot are you satisfied business. now? Granite business. 
Yes, my granite business. <laughs> Nine. <laughs> Do you believe her? Vero. Oh. What do you expect me to say? Okay, this is most again. Yeah? Mm. It's one again. I saw. Vero, why are you shouting? <laughs> Naya saw this in Noguchi's bag. We have been living with a criminal in this house. I don't understand you. Nay, you know this morning, after I asked Noguchi how she got money to pay for her school fees, she told me it's from her granite money. Naya did not believe her one bit. So I went inside to search all her bags and I found this money in one of her bags. You found this in Ugochi's bag. It's a knife. How much is that? Mm. Ugochi. Nai. 70,000 naira. What? 70,000 naira? 70,000 naira. Hey! We have been living with a criminal in this house. Look at it. All right, you know what you will do? Keep this money in your custody until she comes back. Huh? She will explain to us what transpired. Nay, if I did not kill Ugochi in this house today, then my name is no longer Veronica. It's okay. No problem. So, how far have you gone? Has she accepted to be my own? What? Huh. I've been talking to her. Day in, day out, I've been disturbing her about you. And she's responding to me. Oh, really? Yes. Ah, uh, that's good. That means she has accepted to be my wife then. Uh, accepting to be your wife, I can't say. Well, why don't we start with friendship before metamorphosing to wife? I like her so much. In fact, I'm in love with her. And I've been meaning to ask you this. What is your relationship with her? Uh, my relationship with her. She's just my friend. Casual friends here, yeah, that's what we are. Just a friend? Yes, sir. Do you think you can convince her to accept my proposal? Uh, yes, I have been talking to her day in, day out. Okay. Yeah, but uh, um, convincing her to become your wife, mm -hmm. I can't say yes for now, but let's... In fact, she will accept you. She will. Really? Yes, she will. I am very happy now. Udoka. Yes, my friend. Give him the money. Yes, please, just manage that for now. Just manage it. This manage. <laughs> Again, your banner is a manage. <laughs> manage. Hey. More is coming. Hmm? My friends, if I put you in the phone, you can do it. No bother. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Hey. Makes him think I can convince Ugochi to marry him. Just like that. Am I Ugochi's mother? To crown it all, he has been giving me money. Hey. How will I deliver this? How will I deliver? Can I handle this? I 
he has been giving me money. Uh-huh. Well, it's not my fault now. Did, did I ask for any money? He's the one dashing me money. Uh -huh. I can defend it anywhere you want. Ugochi. 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 I need to need to talk this money in your bag. Where did you get this money from? I... I... Hey! Kochi! You have suddenly become a samurai, eh? Uh -uh. eh? So, you have turned yourself into a criminal and a prostitute in my own house, under my nose. No, Uncle. I, I'm not a criminal. Neither am I a prostitute. So... I, I... Where did you get this huge amount of money from? This money was found in your custody. The money you used to pay for school fees, I did not give you. My wife did not give you. Now tell me, where did you get this money from? Papa, what's all this nonsense for now? Uh -huh. Okay, if you want to know, this money is the, is the money she made from the granite business. Yes, uh, exactly. The granite business. Granite business. You are still talking. I don't understand you. How do you get to know the prince? I don't even know where he's from to this village. Are you all right? Listen. It's not a crime to know the prince. I know. Good. He's rich. He loves Gochi and he wants me to talk to her on his behalf. He has been dashing me money, serious money. Ugochi needs someone like the prince. You know why? Because he's rich and he can challenge Ugochi's uncle considering what she's going through in, in, in his hands. Timobi. Hmm? Can you just listen to yourself? You're just talking blah, 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 blah. Can you just listen to yourself? Yeah. You mean you change the words because the so-called prince has given you money you don't know how to pay back? Now, let me ask you. Mm. How are you going to explain this to Gochi? This rubbish you're telling me now. How are you going to explain it to Gochi? Eh? Gochi will understand and even appreciate it. You know why? Gene. Every girl needs a... I'll give me more, I'll give me. Timobi! Eh? Timobi! Who is after you? Um, Papa? Uh, mama? Uh, um, what mama? happened? Uh, uh, Talk! There's, there's, there's problem. Eh? Problem? There's trouble, yes. Yes, in the house. Please. 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 Yes. Please. 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 So you don't want to talk? Talk now! Talk Where did you get that money found in your bag from? Talk now! Talk oh! Talk oh! Before I pieces you with this sharp cutlass! Talk before I shred you into pieces! <laughs> I shred you with this cutlass! Talk now! Huh? Where did you get it from? Talk! 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 What has she done? Why are you people treating her like a slave? Oh, give me. Oh, mama, mama. Please. What is going on? What has she done? Why are you people treating her like a slave? Oh, give me. What are you trying to do? I don't think it's going on. Eh? You pushed me? No, I, I kissed you. Okay. Young man, so you have the guts to enter my own house and push my wife like this? Eh? You're no longer afraid. I'm afraid of who? I'm afraid of who now? Oh, Mr. Don't tell someone like Lisa. this. Lisa. Eh? Why? What, 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 what has she done? Now you want to know. Oh, if, you, if you care to know, I'll tell you. Tell me. 
Find out that you If you care to know, I'll tell you. Okay. Now tell me. Look at look, look, look at look at this, this German woman. How can a small girl like this have this amount of money, this will bring son in her own custody? That money over there was found in her bag. Where did she get the money from? So because of this peanut, you want to disfigure someone's daughter? <laughs> eh? You don't have the right. If you don't know where she got this money from, call the police! Must you treat her like a slave? Alright, if you must know, I personally gave her this money for her school fees and personal use. You are a liar! By the way, now let me ask you, let me ask you, what do you do, Philippine, that you can give this amount to a little girl like this? Eh? Tell me! Commissioner of Police, what I do for a living is none of your business. In Ame, you don't have right to treat someone's daughter like this. Don't try it again. No one should touch this girl again. For the very last time, no one should touch her or treat her like a slave. This is my house. Okay. This is my house. This, 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 this is my house. Well, this is becoming a community and daddy. Oga, Oga, I am respecting your old age. If I rush you, if I rush you, I swear, your life will never remain the same. In my own house. <laughs> okay. Oga, go and come back. You will meet me in this house. Oya, we are not consuming a dinner. Oya, to live and consume a dinner. Go and come back, you come back and meet me. It's your mother, come back here too. You go. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, okay? I have warned your uncle. And trust me, they will never disturb you again. Thank you very much. But what did he say? Don't mind them, they were just moping and blabbing. But trust me, like I said, they will never disturb you again. It's alright, thank you very much. I wonder what I would have done without you. <laughs> thank you. You go. You go. You're too beautiful. Thank you. This is for you. Take it. Wait. Where did you get this? Huge amount from my love. Take it first. No, that no, 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 no. I will not touch it. Else, you tell me where you got it from and what it is for. Ha! Huh. All right, if you insist. You remember that prince I told you about, Prince Gozo? Mm hmm. What about him? That prince is madly in love with you. Yes, sir. He has been disturbing me. He gave me this money to give you. At the point, I was like. Okay, let me throw it open because considering his background, he's from a wealthy home, <laughs> he's rich, he can take good care of you. Yes, I know you love me fine and good, but I have nothing to offer. Look around, no hope, no job, no future. <laughs> so let's be realistic here. Feel free to consider his proposal. That's my point. Chimobi, can you hear yourself speak? Are you alright? What are you doing? I thought you said you love me and you can do anything for our love. You want to sell the love we share for money? Is that it? Oh. Now I know that men can never be trusted. Is this how you are? You, you are giving me money to love the prince? For what? Do you see me as a cheap girl? I am disappointed with what you've just done. What is the meaning of this? Is this how you are? I mean, is this the love you've always promised me? Is this how you want to share the rest of your life with me? Is that it? I don't want to say anything about this. But the only thing I want to say to you right now is that I don't ever want you to come close to me in your life. For this singular act of yours, this relationship is over. No, my no, love, wait, please. It's not that serious yet. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let, let go. In fact, I was joking. I'm sorry. What do you mean you were joking? Please, I'm sorry. You claim you love me, yet you collected money from the police for me to accept this proposal. Why would you do that? 
My love, I'm sorry. Okay. Did I tell you that I love you because of money? No, I'm okay. Have I not seen other suitors yet? I chose you. My love, I'm sorry. I was just joking. Please forgive me. You have disappointed me. If you leave me, I will die. Don't do this, please. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, please. What are you? I'm sorry, don't. Please. You avoid me. No, I'm sorry. Just consider it as a joke. Joke, joke. Don't take it to heart, please. Don't use it against me. I'm sorry. I said I'm sorry. Don't now. Don't cry, please. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. The prince is here. Greetings, my prince. Yes, greeting. How are you? Have you been able to convince her yet? I've been trying my best, but uh, talk to her yourself. Okay. You asked to see me. Yes. Uh... How are you, my beautiful angel? Point of correction, please. I am not your angel. My name is Ugochi. So I would appreciate if you address me as one. I'm sorry about that. Uh, please, come in, come in, come in. Come inside the car. No, 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 I'm not coming in. Whatever you want to say to me, say it. Well, if you insist, uh, I want to know why you've been turning my proposal is down. I've been sending that young man standing there. A series of messages. But they keep telling me you've been rejecting my offer. I want to know. Listen, I love you. I want to marry you. I want to make you the future queen of my kingdom. Listen, I can do anything for you. Actually anything, just think of anything good. I can do it for you. Cars, jewelries. I can build you a mansion if you want. Just marry me. Are you done? <laughs> for now, for now, yes, I am. Fine. Now it's your turn to listen to me. I appreciate everything you have said. But it's best I go straight to the point and not to waste your time. I am not interested. See that man standing over there? He is not just my boyfriend, but my husband to be. I love him very much. In fact, we love ourselves. I am sure you might have told him one or two. But now, let me state it directly to you. It can never work. I am engaged to be married. So please, I will appreciate if you don't stop me on the way again or tell me about this marriage thing because I'm not interested. Can we go now? What, what is wrong with this girl? The money I've been spending on her. I've been giving her money, doing everything to get her. But she's still stubborn. What is, what is wrong with her? Look at the way she's walking. Driver, please move this car. Let's leave here. Nah, that guy is very stubborn. Upon all the promises I made her, she still refuses to accept my proposal. Chimobi, do you think she will accept me later? My, my, my prince, don't give up. You know why? She's a woman. She will always want you to romance her ego, you know. But every woman has pride in her. So just give her a little time. Don't give up. She must succumb. But she said you are her love and husband to be. Ah? Uh -huh. How come I get her? How? Just. What kind of girl will reject a prince and follow someone like me? 
She's just trying to scare you away to see how grounded and strong you are. Don't give up. I can't wait to have her as my wife and the future queen of my kingdom. My prince, look at what you will do. She's a woman and they love material things. So buy her clothes. In fact, give me money, let me shop for her. Spoil her with money. She will soften her heart. That's the only way to show. 